it's an awake procedure. Uh, these can be done in general. We've talked about that. Some patients may opt to, uh, for whatever reason, to want to do a general aesthetic. But I think that uh, the technique is there's less blood loss. I see less post-op wound complications like infection, drainage. Uh, patients are up and active uh, much quicker. Dr. Saunders also emphasizes that a Texas tummy tuck procedure is part of an overall body harmony plan. The part of doing like the Texas tummy tuck is not just removing the excess skin, mm -hmm. but it's also in terms of health uh, to try to get a patient's weight down. It's a more of a lifestyle change. So the first part of this procedure is actually to numb the patient up adequately. The second part is to actually do the liposuction, and then the third part will actually be removing the excess skin and fat that we don't want to flatten out her belly. Now, the other thing we're going to do a little bit different with the Texas tummy tuck is we're going to use the uh, patient's own platelets, and the platelets have all the growth factors in it uh, to help promote and accelerate wound healing. We've done um, most of the liposuction on this side, so the, the skin has become very loose that allow us then to pull the blue line down to this purple line. Um, and we'll just go ahead and excise all this and then make a new belly button. We removed a 20 centimeter uh, from head to toe flap and it was 50 centimeters long. Here, hold this right now we're doing some progressive sutures and we're gonna irrigate the um, the wound, some bacitracin, just kind of clean it, and then we're just going to start closing, and we'll be done. The results are dramatic and immediate. Dr. Saunders is also confident that an otherwise healthy patient can benefit greatly from a Texas tummy tuck. Anybody that has uh, abdominal wall laxity, especially women after having uh, their family, I wouldn't recommend it if it's a woman that she had one baby, but they're still thinking about maybe having a, uh, another child it's appropriate for men also. It doesn't replace doing core exercises. Core exercises to keep your abdominal muscles strong. Uh, it, it's part and parcel, I mean, it goes with it. But the person who's got loose skin, um, a lax uh, abdominal wall muscle, excess fat would be a good candidate for this.